I believe I am on. Greetings. Um, this is the hundredth ish sub stream, um, and it's going to be my first ever gaming stream. I'm going to do Fresco Wizard. Um, it's for Leo Scrius, who I did actually ban last night, and I don't know how to get onto your channel to unban you, Doshin. So if you ever hear this or see this, uh, let me know and I'll un un um, unban you because it's not very nice of me to unban, uh, to ban my 100th subscriber. So there's that. Um, I'm also going to give you a prize, which is um, an AI art of anything you want. Let me know. It can be a series. It can be anything. Let me know and I'll do it. Hey, up, Luke. All right. Sorry I didn't get to finish our conversation. My sister turned up. So um, I'm glad someone's here to see. But you can let me know if the sound works and things like that, because I've never done this before. So uh, if it will let me do it. So this game is one of the ones that came from my mum. She gave me a whole load of... Yeah, I'll check it out. I'll see how it all turned out afterwards. Yeah, my sister turned up, and then my friend turned up, and it was just like a couple of hours of just solid, solid stuff. And then... Um, and then I'm free now. I'm free all night. So I've cracked open the books Fizz for my 100th uh, subscriber. Do chin, chin, chin. Um, and yeah, if it weren't for him, I'd probably be on 50. So there we are. So yeah, this game was one that I remember playing at the time. It came out in 2005. I played it more recently with my kid. And then we forgot about it. And then I played it recently at my mum's. Um, but there's this whole, all right, Kyria, nice to see you. Um, but I don't know if anyone's heard of these sorts of these games. It's Puzzle Lab, and um, they are actually still going. Oh my God! It's Moon Soon. Hello, bloody hell! Nice extravaganza. Indeed, nice to see you, mate. I was thinking about you the other day, wondering what had happened to you. Yeah, man, you have to let us know what's been going on um, in the world. But yeah, this I've done a bit of research into this company at Puzzle Lab, and there's very little on them actually. They're from Lithuania, but there's quite a few games that I've got of theirs. I don't know what all the dates are because I've like looked at lists, lists where they're going. These are all the games that this company have brought out, and it's like half the ones that I've got on there. So, and they're from like the mid two thousands. <sighs> so we're covering the moon. All sorts of got all sorts of stuffs going on. Have you heard? Have you been about Moon Soon? Do you know about all the crazy, crazy stuff? The crazy stuff. Chin chin, everybody. Right, so let's have a go. And you can tell me if you can hear what I'm talking. I've never done it before. Oh, okay. Let's see if I can do it again. Oh, I can't see it. What is your picture? Oh, I can't see. Okay. Oh, mate, check it out. Yay, Sierra, yes. Um, you maybe need the Kin Han KKK, possibly. But yes, I'm going to start on the uh, thingy levels. We, my, my kid always always tries to make me go on light mode which i'm not going to do tree tony tree it's six thirty here Thirty tree and a turd so this one you've got three options um i think i'll go with that fairy but if you can see her they've got really interesting art oh thanks moon soon yeah it was um it was doshin it was all doshin so let's start the game. Can you hear me all right while this is playing? I'm assuming so. So, scene one. I'm going to do all the games. There's one that I've got that don't doesn't work on this computer, but there's a lot of them. The music's great. Hey, up, Sierra. We've got two. We've got two here. What? Hey, up. Well, there we go. Oh, now I've bloody balls it up. I've got to remember not to do that. I've got to remember not to do that. I've never done this before. So I'll do it again. Okay. I've got to remember, I'm such a novice at this. 
right. Sierra, is that the real Sierra? Because if so, wowzers, what's you gonna? Hey, your people. Hey, the gang's all here. Yeah, man, is it working? Is it working? That's the question. So, are you ready for the excitement of Fresco Wizard? In which the wizard enters the enchanted kingdom and helps to free from evil the bellflower. <laughs> bellflower manor! <laughs> the wizard enters the kingdom and the first place he comes to is the bellflower manor, which was evilly enchanted by the wicked sorcerer. Puzzle monster. The wizard sees various mosaics. Yeah, well, the, these guys are still going. Well, I think they were still going up until 2016 where they were making, I think they are still making phone games potentially um enters the kingdom first place it comes to belfar manor wizard sees various mosaics which barely resemble the beautiful objects they once were he decides to save the dwellers of the bellflower manor by re removing the evil curse of the puzzle monster yeah it is it's good to see everyone a screaming child in the background that'll be dean yeah he's he's obsessed mate he's absolutely obsessed with my child um, what happens is, is I wait until my kid's not here or in bed at the weekends and that's it. The kid's never around. Um, there used to be the odd one in the mornings when I used to do it in the morning. Um, but really, it's it's complete fabrication, that may. Absolute, complete fabrication. It's all projection. Yeah, it's all projection. Right, anyway. Yay! Cheers, Moon Soon. So we start with an easy one, look. Start with an easy one. Oh, you need to be careful. Oh, once you've got them, once you've got them, you can't get rid of them. Or oh, maybe you can. It's one of these. It's one of these, mate. Yeah, exactly. I see you wait until they're asleep. What's the point? Otherwise, ugh, it's just going to be annoying. It's going to be annoying. I did think about doing something with lever ones because we're both in um like around europe and stuff and i thought about maybe like buying him off with some switch time or something but i was like nah man like my, that's my time for him so sometimes he just wants to go on the computer Bloody hell. and that's fine you know but it means i'm not going to do anything so now it's just one of these but there are other ones so yeah that's right you can go between between the parts of bellflower yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Yeah, from 2005, Judge Judy. Oh, mate, I've got a lot. I've got them all. I've got them all, mate. I've got um, I've got Insane Aquarium to do. I've got Big Kahuna Reef. I've got loads of them. All the really old ones. Some of them don't even work on my computer anymore. Like, um, it's really to test it than anything else. But I really like the music and stuff in this game. Um... What else have I got? Yeah, fucking Wheel of Fortune won't work. We've got Jeopardy. Just random. It is, it's just Tetris. It's just Tetris. It's just Amico. It's just a load of... They do stuff like this, basically. So they've got this one. There's a few. But, like, you can see how they were sort of prepping it for these phone games in the future. You know what I mean? Like, this is now, like, proper phone game fodder, isn't it? Like, then it was an actual game. You played on your sat on your computer and played like I'm doing right now. You actually sit at a computer playing it. Oh, there are these as well. I keep forgetting about those. But Fibre Twig is a better version of this. Um uh, I've really got shit spatial awareness. There we are. It's good to know that, yeah, exactly. These are mum's games, mum games. These are all the ones I got from my mum. I've got Zuma, I've got um, Holiday Express, all the ones that I never played and I still haven't played them because, like, my mum put me off. Uh, there's loads of them, Fucking millions of them. Hey, oh, Don King's is Donkey Kong channel. Yeah, Zuma. I never played that one. Dino Dash. I never played that one. But um, we've, oh, I don't know if I've got that one, but we had um, Mystic Inn, which was similar, I think, where you had to make potions for people. 
and it just got a little bit more complicated every time. Retro Bros here, is eh? Hey, up, Retro Bro, I don't see you. Uh, didn't see you come in there. I'm just going round and round here. Yeah, I mean, it's not that interesting, but I spent a night playing this. So I'm, not, I'm not ashamed to say one night once I got it on for my kids to play. And then I had wanted to play it and I sat there and finished it. Like, trying that album and Dean TV Army, but I don't think they like me very much. Oh, do they not? Well, they don't like themselves very much, mate. I mean, they don't like anyone. They don't do friends and what. Exactly, mums were all playing. That's why I thought I'd do mum games. These are these are mum games. These came from my mum. Like they're literally from my mum. So that and um, Enya, she put me off Enya a little bit as well because she played that too much. And uh, Clanad, but I do like Clanad. So yeah, this is this is that. But I should at least finish this scene, and then we're we'll going to another puzzle puzzle game, puzzle whatever they're called, puzzle lab, puzzle lab game. Um, the only site I saw was an assets, just an asset site where they were selling some of their stuff and they had good reviews for their assets and they had quite a few. Um, I didn't look at them, but um, that's the only thing. And then that was linked to a website, which I then looked at and the name is probably outdated from a very, very long time ago. Uh -huh, uh -huh. All right, Doshin. Um, if that is you, Doshin, uh, I don't know who that is. If that is that, is that even Doshin? Doshin, if that's you, say something that. Um, Oh, what? Level one? Level failed? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Bloody... Oh, is it time? Oh, I don't bloody know. Oh, Darius. Nah, mate. He's a fucking... He's an obhead. It's all about him all the time. It was just about his own psychological bullshit you know he said he never cared about anyone which is fair enough but then he really did want everybody to um look after him so there never was an army it's just he tried to he sort of went with whatever albert said because it suited him as simple as that weak rottweiler was it kitten surrounded by rottweilers or so he thought what the hell's going on there Classic British stream, yeah. I mean, this this is from Lithuania, but it's properly like European. -y. The music and everything, all their music, all their art is really similar, like this. It's a very exciting game, EV, 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 very exciting. Um, it stood the test of time in my house. It still gets pulled out occasionally, and I think it's because we all like the music. <laughs> Because um, you can get as many of these games as you want, can't you now? Especially for free, just play on your phone. Ah, you don't get much of one of them teapots. Oh, well, let's go over here. What am I, what did I do wrong to make that level not work, I wonder? Am I uh, not doing things in time? Or maybe I should be quicker. Yeah, so I expect to bore everybody and everyone fuck off fairly soon because it's, it, you know, it's not going to be very interesting. But I will, I'll showcase a few of these Puzzle Lab games. Um, there's Puzzle Inlay, and then there was Crystal Path, and then there was another one which I don't think we could get working. And then there's the, the actual best one ever, which is Fibre Twig. 
which was the original one that I played. But yeah, this is a mum game, massively. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. They probably couldn't afford it, though. That's the problem. They're really small, this company as well. I'm surprised they didn't get sucked into it, to be honest. It's exactly the perfect sort of um, company that they would have gone after from the looks of it. But they've stuck to their own bloody style for like 20 years. They've made the same fucking sort of game. Ah, oh, I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that. Now I lost my I lost my triangle. Oh no, I didn't. This is the cornhole right here. That, that's the cornhole right here. Look I'll show you. Cornhole. Is that you, Dorshin, or is that someone else taking Evie's name in vain? <gasps> no! Is that you? Don Kingsley's Donkey Kong channel, is that you? Oh, please say it's so. <gasps> oh, are you? Oh. Blink once for yes and twice for no. Oh, do oh do come back if it is you. Come on, it's oh mate, I wanted to know what you got to say about all the Darius shit, mate. Come on, if that is you. Fucking hell, I'll give you the streamyard link. Cause I was like, cause I remember King of All Buttocks always used to say is a herb, is a fucking herb, and he he never had time for Darius. He always thought he was a fucking wanker. Um. So I'd be interested to see what he thinks of all this. Oh, right. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. He's still in hiding. Um, well, Green of All Buttocks is um, he's just someone who's, someone who we used to know, you know. He's just... He's a very dear friend of the stream. <laughs> he's a good one. This old Jewish guy who got scared off the platform by Q. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Yeah, pretty much. He, um, if you want to see anything about buttocks, you should go back and look at my um, my advent calendar. It's full of him, absolutely full of buttocks and D read, especially the later ones. Some of my favourite videos I ever made are in there from what the ones that I did for buttocks. Doshin Kong's my donkey. Oh dear. That's got to be Doshin. That's got to be. So if that is you, Doshin, you've won a prize. You've won a prize for being my 100th subscriber. Oh. Oh, mate, that would be awesome. It would be awesome for uh, King of All Buttocks to come back. Oh, but man, can you imagine what had happened? Because I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, Don, I'll tell you what he is, what he was. He was the kiss of life for Dean every goddamn fucking time, and he loved it, and he knew that's what he did, and he knew it pissed everybody off, and he used to do it on purpose. And he'd, he'd wait, and it was like, I don't know if you've ever watched any um, Doctor Who, but there's an episode of Doctor Who where Rose touches the fucking Daleks and he sets the whole thing off again. And he's like, no, don't touch it, whatever you do. And by the time he said it, she's touched it. She's touched that Dalek. And that's it. That's the start of like however many episodes, fucking series of that, of that show. If she hadn't touched that fucking Dalek, then there wouldn't have been a show. And that's what Buttocks is. To my annoyance. <laughs> And my amusement as well. Oh, Billy Mitchell. I finally, finally got to hear some of the stories of the Billy Mitchell, but I don't think I, I missed a lot of it. 
a lot of because you guys were recapping it all from the beginning and i missed a lot of it but what i did notice about him was his grim reaper hair it's unbelievable isn't it It really is like do you think he keeps the rain off oh i don't know there might be there's a lot of um like spin-offs that i haven't seen and a lot of stuff from like christmases and stuff like that that i just haven't seen uh, the modern stuff but anything with um david tennant in is absolutely absolutely fucking amazing um and then the other guy matt whatever his face is who's on afterwards he was he was amazing as well very very good doctors ah oh, that was what killed me last time see i bet my mum used to do it on untap oh no oh no go go oh god call holio oh oh so close see it's getting exciting now it's getting exciting now guys you thought it was boring no i haven't energized my bloody teapot either fucked it mate Oh no, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Mm, see how concentrated how much I'm concentrating now. Uh, this one. Yes. Bellflower House. Bellflower Manor, eh? Who would have thought it? So a couple of them. I've played this so many times with my kid and I'm just sort of like, come on, let's do it, let's do it, let's do the next scene, come on. He's like, I'm bored, mum, I'm bored, I've had enough now. What have I done, two, two scenes? I'm gonna do the whole thing. Won't have it. So now I'll make you guys watch me do it. <laughs> but anyway. Hey, Rada, hey! Oh, I died. I died. You distracted me, Ron. How dare you? How dare you? How do you do it, Evil? How do you do it? I don't know how you do it and not get distracted. I'm drinking as well. Yeah, I know. Do I do it again? Can I be asked? Maybe I can't be asked. Maybe we'll go back to this one later. And I'll put on. Hopefully you'll still be here. I'm gonna have to come off the thing for a minute. No, a J in the chat. A J. What? Oh. Oh, a J. All oh, right. I thought it was like F's in the chart or something. Okay. Okay, right. So I'm going to go and see if I can get Fibre Twig up. Hopefully you can still hear me. Do, do, do. Oh, God. I think it's loading for the first time. Oh. This one looks more modern. Okay. Are you still there? Yes. Not C. C area is not generally a not C. What does that mean? <sighs> He doesn't ignore it. I'm the one who ignores my chat. No, evil's really good. Oh, it will. It will. Oh, Don, is it you? Is it you? I believe you that you're not him. So how did you get to hear about Buttocks then? Did you hear about him from Dean and that? How did you hear about him? If you if you don't know him. Where did you, uh, where did you find out about him? Let's have a look at this then. See if we can have a go. I, I do like Fiber Twig the most out of all of the. What? Oh, why isn't it working? Share screen. No sharing. Stop that. 
Huh. Huh. E King. Oh, is E King Don Kingsley? Oh, all right. Oh, Coab. Oh, bless his heart. He's a good un. He's a good un. Is it? Is all you need to know about Buttex. He's a massive troll, but he's a good un. He's a he's a rough diamond with a heart of gold. What the fuck is an E King? Well, mm, Don Kingsley. I think you are Coab. I think you are. How do we, how do we, yeah, I do as well. I smell, I smell something coming out of Don Kingsley. Don Kingsley, do you like Jimmy Savile? Are you a fan of Jimmy Savile? <laughs> it's not showing fibre fiber twig. I don't know how to fix that. I just click share screen and it just does nothing. Um, let's see. Jimmy who? Okay, all right, fair enough. Fair enough. You're not him. You're not him. You're not him. Oh, it is running. It is running. It is running, so it's the stream yards, maybe. So it's not working. Oh, well, that's annoying, isn't it? Hmm. <laughs> Oh, bless him. I wonder what he's doing. I wonder what he's doing right now. Um, Not really thought much of it, really, to be honest. But I was thinking about him the other day. I was thinking about Moon Soon. I'm really glad Moon Soon came back. That's awesome. Um, oh, fucking hell, I'm annoyed. I can't. Oh, I love them. I don't know if I've got any of them, though. I might have a pirate one. I might have a pirate one that came on that list. Let's have a look, see what there is. There's loads of shit. I've got loads of shit on there. But if it's not sharing, if it's not sharing my streamlabs of any sort, then I'm going to have to come out and then go back in again. But I've done that before, haven't I? And it did work. So I'll try that in a minute. But for now... Hmm. Oh, damn it. My kid has put them in a random folder and I don't know where they are, all those games. I should have checked. I knew that if I know the name of the game, I can just search for it, but um, I don't know where it is. Oh, maybe I can find it. Bear with me a second, guys. I'll just have a look. Uh, Where is it? Ah, okay. We've got... I'm looking for... I've got all sorts of crazy shit in here. Reader's Digest, Super Word Power, uh, Super Collapse, Super Fruit Frolic, Super Pop and Drop, Super SpongeBob Collapse, Word Joel, Word Singer, Word Jong to Go. I actually played that one quite a lot. Um, Turtle Bay. Let's try. Oh, they've got Dyna Dash. I don't think I played it. Let's try that one then. Let's try that one. Oh. Oh god, I've got Oh god. Okay. Oh, I have played this before. Uh, options. Oh, I don't want to play this. I will give it a go, I suppose. Right, let's see if it'll share the screen. SpongeBob Power Wash Simulator. Is there such a thing? Is there such a thing? 
I can't find the Search and Find game. I did have one, but I will. I will get. I will. I'll download some of them. I'll get some of them hidden object games. I think we should make one. I don't know how to make one, but I'm going to find out how to do it on the AI and make my own. Oh, oh, oh! Yeah, we could just have it as a thing at the end of the stream. Substance abuse counselling. Um, excuse me, I've not had any weed for the last couple of hours. I'll have you know, I am drinking Bucks Fizz though, but it's um, warranted because I got a hundred subscribers because of Dorshi. So there you go. Um, let's see if it will let me share my screen now. No, that means it's StreamYard. Okay, right, I'm going to close it, but not end the stream. And hopefully I will still be here. So fingers crossed. I'll see you on the other side, guys. Thank you very much, Don Kingsley. I appreciate it. Right, I'm just going to close that. Ah, you couldn't hear me. Hello. Yes, I was not added back to the stream. I've gone back on and then it says you are sharing another application window, which is not true. <laughs> that ain't true. That ain't true. Uh, Share screen and now it will do the same thing that it did before, which is just act like I've never clicked on that. Which I always wonder where does that information go? Where does that information go? Uh, stop sharing. Okay. And now it's just doing that. Is there some sort of. Ah. Yeah, well, it was. Yeah, I was trying to do Fiber Twig. Um, it looks like I can only share one game per stream and then it will just say that I'm sharing the same. I'm trying to, sh I was basically I was sharing um, Fresco Wizard Evil and then I got bored of, well I died because Ron came and distracted me. <laughs> um, but then um, I tried to put on the next Puzzle Lab game and it won't, it keeps saying, even though I've closed the other one, it won't forget it and so it's saying i'm still sharing which means and only get one chance at that one chance and then once it said that there's nothing i can do about that it says oh you share another screen so okay um then that disappears you can get it back but once it's done that you can't close the screen start another screen do anything like that it's not letting me neither it's not letting me um it's it, you know, I click on present, click square, sh square sh uh, share screen, and it's just as if I'm not clicking anything at all. Um, it's just like as if, and that's what I was wondering is like that click does something somewhere, doesn't it? You know what I mean? Where, how does it not, where does it go? You know what I mean? Like the laws of thermodynamics, when you write a text and it disappears, where does that information go? It must go somewhere. In fact, that energy doesn't go into nothing, does it? In the universe. So that's that's the interesting one. But yeah, it's not. Uh, and so what I did then, Eva, was I came out of StreamYards, came out of StreamYards, went back, and then it loaded it up again and it let me choose the screens, which means I think that it's in its cache or something. Um, and then it won't forget it. 
So then it, this time, and then it let me share the screen. It let me have a look at the options. So then I clicked on the screen. And when I did, it said, oh, you're sharing another screen, same as. And then I went back straight to where I was before, which is before I exited. I've not tried that. What, just like a video file? Uh, yes, I believe I can. Um, let's try. Um, for the universe to know itself, Don Kingsley's Donkey Kong channel. That's all it is. We're just the eyes and ears. We're just part of. We're just one of the senses. Some of the senses of the universe. We're just the ones that log it. And someone else and somewhere else is the bit is the brain. You know, we're all part of the brain, but we're more like the eyes and shit. Uh, let's find a video. I've got in here. I've got loads of shit in here. Oh, Let's put this on. All right, is that working? Do 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 do. Fucking Amico after dark. Fucking Amico burns deep inside my heart. Fucking Amico oh, after dark. Enough. It's where you can astro smash my cornhole. Fucking Amico after dark. Fucking Amico burns deep inside my heart. Fucking Amico after dark is where you can astro smash my cornhole. We will go skiing and swim with the shark shark. We will fly to the moon and be on patrol you won't be running man because in the end we will be friends cause that's how we do in amico after dark fucking amico burns deep inside my heart fucking amico after dark is where you can Astro smash my cornhole. Isn't it beautiful? Amico. That guy, that guy singing it. This beautiful, beautiful guy here. Right, one of the founding fathers. Right. Okay, so I've shared that. I now remove that. I now present my screen. And it didn't work. But it was worth a shot. That was definitely worth a shot. Mm. 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 So I can't even share like a YouTube or something. It's very strange. Mm. Well, I suppose I'll have to maybe call it, call it a day until I can work out how to do it. We did get a bit of uh, Fresco Wizard. Um, I'll try one more time leaving StreamYard and coming back in. Uh, but um, if it doesn't work, then I suppose I can't really do it. Right then, I've closed all of them down apart from a screamyard window. Maybe that'll help. Um, I need to get my 
game working first. Okay. Fingers crossed. And then after all that, it's just a puzzle game. It's nothing amazing. It's just like a little mid 2000s puzzle game from the computer. Um after all that. But you know, it's the it's the thing, it's doing the thing that does it. It's coming up with an option. And so then I click on that. It's mm, last time. Or maybe entire screen. And then if I go, but then I'll have to close this. I wonder if you can still hear me. Can you still hear me if I do that? Can you guys still hear me if I do that, yeah? Um, I need my phone, really, so I can check. Where is my phone? Where is my Sorry for the fail on this one, guys, but I will get... Oh, you can hear me, yeah. But I'll not be able to see the chat when... Um, so if I go on my phone, this might be a way of jigging it somehow. Um, oh, oh God, let me turn that down. Okay, so you can hear me loud and clear at this point. Um, so now, if I now... Web. Okay. Flip window or screen. Yeah. Why is it saying not now? Try to allow. Entire screen. Allow. Okay. Allow. That should show the screen. And now I can see if it actually works or not. Yes, it's working. Hooray! Oh, thank you, Donkey English Donkey Kong channel. I've managed to work it out, kind of. Jigging it about a bit. That's like my robot collection, that picture on my, on my thing. Right, so this is Fibre Twig, and this is, we'll have it on normal, and it's just one of these, so what's that one with the, with the pipe, oh my god it's fast, bloody hell, not used to it, what's that pipe game, is it a Mario game with the pipe? Yeah, great success! Yeah, cheers! I'm proud of myself. I have kind of, it's kind of a jimmied scenario. It's not quite right, but, you know. I didn't just have a tantrum about it, so that's good. That's a bonus. No, oh, see. Don't want you, don't want your little upside down heart. Oh, you see, if I do that then... Oh, no, but I do want you now, because now I can turn off the chi. They say the chi will escape out of there if I'm not careful. Oh, dear me. Look at the state of this. It was so fast on ease, on hot, on normal. Oh, my God. I'm used to, like, zen. Oh, God. So... Oh, bloody hell. You don't want the cheat to escape, whatever. Oh, Fiber Twig's brilliant. I love Fiber Twig. This is another one that I got stuck playing for ages. It's just the music that I like, really. Yes, it's very interesting. I think it's a little bit more interesting than um, Fresco Wizard. But, you know, for its time, it was pretty generic. <laughs> but I think their art style was interesting for the time. And... The music was cool and obviously they've done i would imagine they did very very well out of phone games these guys and as i say the last one i saw was out in 2016. it's 
so now I've just got to do this now until one of these turns up. Whee! Yeah, it should be bells, it is like that. Level complete! You get this lovely little thing. Oh, look at this ravishing beauty here playing the la the liar, I believe it is. So, this is among the flowers in the garden of the beautiful enchantress. Isn't she beautiful? She's going to be a five o'clock shadow, but she ain't doing too bad. So, we've got some flowers. Oh, we're in the garden still. So it's all gardens, isn't it? These days. Cheers, evil. GG indeed on the first level. I wonder if there's a time thing. I did briefly look on YouTube. I didn't look at any videos, but there are leaderboards, I think, of people with high scores on this game. So, like with all niche things, I think there might be a, a place to do some stupid stuff with this game, maybe. Somewhere there's some mums that do knitting and fibre twig or something. Yeah, it's definitely got that, that music though, hasn't it? Like, from the late 90s, early 2000s. Ambiance. Oh, I've got a hammer. Oh, I should have used one there. Oh, tight ass bastards. See now, look. Oh, fairies. God damn. See how stupid you have to be with this. To maintain the chi. Ah. Yeah, this was one of those ones during lockdown. It was, we rediscovered it and ended up. I just ended up sitting up all night playing it. Um, not really. It's not really. I've got it on normal. I've not played it on hard. I might play it on hard. That's what I'm playing. Which game is it? There's like a Mario plumber game. Oh yeah, he is a plumber. Of course he is. Is there a Mario plumber game? I don't know. Um, where you have to do pipes. Um, well, as always, nothing. It just it gets it all for free, doesn't it? Do you know what I mean? He promised me the world. He promised me that he'd it make me it'd take me far. He didn't. I didn't. You know, I didn't charge him. I just did it for the clout. I didn't even get a ride in his um, bloody Ferrari. Stop giving them out after a bit. Like that fucking birthday card business that we're all supposed the people were supposed to get a birthday card with, huh? Oh look, we've got all these down here. Is it a birthday card, birthday cake, special special uh ooh, you went mad didn't I with this big stories? Oh what did I watch? I watched a really interesting um narc thing the other day. Oh it was a woman who um killed her husband and they'd offered her manslaughter and she wouldn't take it because she was too proud and too much of a narc and then they gave her 25 years but she should have had loads more they just felt sorry for her but um she just wouldn't even take the manslaughter free game on your birthday and the candle yeah exactly yeah like there's just no need is there there's just no need to make those lies up that was what threw everyone, I think, because it was like, 
it, the, the clues were there that it was a scam for me it was like i could never get past as soon as that came out about the um about the loan and they were paying themselves back on interest it was like there you go like what else can be said at this point um but then it was shit like that that threw me because i'd be like well why would you lie about that then if it was just doing some sort of scam it was just scam meets absolute crazy psychosis like beautiful beautiful thing yeah man <laughs> Fairy plumbing. This is the karma engine. This is how you build it. But yeah, um, what Evil was saying last night about the um, about the Amico Awards and stuff, we should totally do that. I'm well up for doing an award ceremony. Um, I definitely think we should do it as a group, maybe though, because it's a lot. I think Potion put a lot of work into that. Um, but I am up for it. Oh, I had one of these all along. Ah. No. Ah. Why is that all working? Look at this. Oh, yeah. It's just like Tetris in the sense that you never get the piece that you want, evil. I swear to God. It's like they know. It's like they bloody know. It's like they know what piece is coming next. How dare they? Like, what's going on here? Oh, that. I had a leaking chi. Right. When I was doing the Zen thing, I was just doing these like really crazy, um, ridiculous structures and just going mad and filling every little bit up with like these tubes and stuff, seeing how much I could drag it out and stuff. That's what I'm like when I play chess sometimes. Oh yes! Oh cool spot! Oh yeah, I had that! That was a Master System player. That was me. Oh. And I have got the old one. I have got it somewhere. I should go and get it. Oh this is ridiculous. I'm going to die. Just got to keep on top of the bastard. But I am a bin. Damn you. What am I supposed to do? Oh my god. Oh, I want that. Okay. Tie off the tube. Oh, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful lady. Beautiful. And then later on, you get these leap of faiths where you just get three and then you've got to decide which one to go up and one of them's going to be a dead end and all that shite. Want to see a. Woohoo! See, now I've got to get up here with that. How is that even supposed to happen? Or maybe not. Woo! The 
Enchantress was no match for me. Yeah, well, Tommy Tallarico couldn't hold a torch to the music on this game. Those Lithuanian guys, is she all over it? Thank you very much, GG's. Even she's saying GG's. The music's right good. This music reminds me a little bit of um, Buster Move music. Look at this. Look at that. It's like, is it really necessary to have the legs of Kimbo? It's like, <laughs> what the fuck? That's why I love it. That's why I love it. Because the art is just it's that little bit janky. Look at it. I love it. I love it. I mean, this has got that element of the um, hidden object games. And you can imagine what I was like when I first started playing this. Because I didn't play this one at the time. I played this one way later. And I just love these, like, massively out of scale, whatever these sort of images are that they put on. And you get that in some of those hidden object games sometimes. They're my favourite, the ones that are just, like, really shittily art, shitty art from the olden days. Uh, what? Okay. That has never happened before. Where nothing, what is it? Where... Nothing could possibly go wrong. Let's possibly go wrong. That's the first thing that ever went wrong. I say. Yeah, so expect this sort of thing from me when it comes to um when it comes to games for, for the first bit it's gonna all just be stuff that i can play on my computer um quite easily and all these flash games i've got from a million years ago i'm definitely i'm gonna do big kahuna reef I'm definitely i'm gonna do um that other one it's an Aquarius with you. Oh, not this again. With um, you remember City San Aquarius? I'm sure everybody's played that. With fish and the aliens. Oh, say, say. Not even Naga, really? Wow. <laughs> I have got Wheel of Fortune. Last time I tried it on my laptop, it wouldn't work. Whether it'll work on this, I'm not sure. But you've got Wheel of Fortune anyway. And I always seem to miss them. But I'm well up for if you do a Jeopardy or a Wheel of Fortune, let me know. Because I miss those streams. And since Moon Soon's back... We should. And if Dorshin doesn't tell me what he wants for his AI art for his hundredth for his hundredth thing, I'll choose it for him. And he might not like the result. If he's watching. <laughs> oh cheers evil, that's awesome. That 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 does mean a lot actually. Yeah, I'll, I'll, that's it. I just thought weird games. There's really not much information about this game company. So I thought it would be kind of interesting for that reason. And like you say, it's a very British... It just gives it that different different vibe a little bit, doesn't it? These like weird little crazy games. So there's Crystal Path as well. I think that one's a bit older than this one. This one looks a little bit, a little bit more polished than uh, the others. And there's a load of new ones, well, say new from 2016, so you can always try those ones as well. It's pretty much the same thing. Oh no, I would be very gutted. I would be very gutted. Oh shit, I'm dying. Oh. 
So here she is, legs akimbo. How are you doing? How's your crow? Can I put this around under your, under your Cuban heel? <laughs> It's just a fibre twig. You don't even know what it is. It's not a pipe. It's not a. It's just a, a fibre twig that channels chi. Oh, it's always on them three parters. I don't like that. Oh. Damn. Damn you. I need some straight and narrows. God damn. Still in need, still in need of the old straights. Look at this ridiculousness. You beast! Damn! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! What do I do? What do I do? Yes! Oh! That's what this is for. So I charge that motherfucker up, right? Oh, I'm an idiot. Could have done that all along. Way! Oh, cheers, potion! Yeah! 100 deep! Pull up, motherfucker! Oh, nice to see you, mate. I was wondering about you the other day as well. See, I'm wondering what people are up to. And we were talking about doing um, an awards, maybe. So obviously your name got mentioned. But yeah, I mean, it's a big, it's a lot of work, isn't it? One of them. <laughs> no, dude, you're not posh. I know who you are. I know who you are. I worked it out. It wasn't hard. I always think people are just stay for a very long time. I think I thought Judy was justy for a long time. Oh, nice one, Potion! I didn't know you got 1K. Is that from um, from the comic comic book stuff? Oh, fuck it all. Oh, what's wrong here? What's going on? All oh, right. What do you think of this game potion? <laughs> it's a bit of a weird one. Ooh. I didn't know you could do that. I didn't know you could join to things that didn't exist if we got that. That's interesting. Oh. Look at this. All right. Okay. Does it take you back to watching your mum when you were younger? Or coming in, 
coming in, going and getting the biscuit barrel after you've been out, getting stoned. And you come in, come round to go down to your mum's for Sunday dinner in your early twenties. Prized yourself out of your flat, off your hangover, to go and do the family thing. And then you get there, and at some point your mum's playing this or something like this. Damn. Oh, nice! Excellent. Well, there's going to be loads more of games coming with these potion. Um, so I was saying earlier, like I did a bit of research into the people who did it because I've always been interested in who did these games because they're just a bit weird. Um, and it's just that you'd like you'd expect this like cottage industry type affair, very very quiet. But they've got a very distinct style. So that's quite interesting that there's just nothing about them really. I think, you know, they might even still be active now. I got the name of the main guy. And that's about it. Well, congrats on the 1K though. That's fucking brilliant. Uh, finally, I can get rid of some of these bloody things. Ugh. Okay. Oh, my God. God. It is hard. Oh, God. Do you know what this song? This song reminds me of um, Oxygen. Jean Michel Jean. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, you buggers. Bloody buggers. It's like I'm making a, a tuber or something. What? Oh my god. What's the problem here? Okay. Oh, there, there. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, I'm screwed, guys. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Screwed, mate. Oh, no. Where is it? Oh, no. Did you see that? How close. I forgot I had it. I was just about to click on it. And I. Oh, man. Jesus. <laughs> Legs of Kimbo! Legs of Kimbo! I'm going to do it again, I'm going to go it again. No safe states on this one. Sad leg, I'll start again. Oh, what, I'll just start at the beginning? No, 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 I'm here, I'm here. Let's see if I can speed run it. I've learned from my mistakes. Yeah, well, no, we've got a problem with that, but I don't understand it.
The worst movie is no movie with this game. That's what I learned from my last. I feel I'm being more efficient in my usage at this point. I know, no, well that's it, you think it's kind of intuitive, but actually it does, it works. I know, I was doing that before, I was trying to reduce the amount of vents, but actually, um, it's it's mad, but you do end up better off. Because you have so many that have got holes, and so if you try and avoid it, you just, if you want to hide into nowhere, you may as well just be free with the vents, allow them to be. Um, see, I was getting loads of stuff stored up because I didn't want to use them, the ones that, hold, that had holes in. So, yeah, the worst move is no move when it comes to this. Oh, shut up. I, is this what I didn't... I forgot about this. The magic teapot. Yeah, I was never big on Xbox, but that's, I was never big on that much, really. Big on my master system, I love that. Okay, so what's the problem? Um, Oh, you'd love the display in the museum that I went to recently. It was all the Donkey Kongs, all of them. It was good. They got a Tetris one as well, which I think I sent up some pictures in the Discord of that. And that was called the Pepsi Tetris. Was it Tetris? Oh, was it Tetris? What was it? I can't remember what it was though. I think it was Pepsi Tetris. Oh my god. No, my um strategy didn't work, did it? Okay, got it in hand. This crisis will be averted. Chi crisis. They're my favourite ones, the little ones that stick out on the end like that. you can just go straight up but this one i know i've got to move it across here because this thing needs um power in 
Which is, I think, why he makes that funny thing, actually, now I think about it. So as you can see, there's always more than one way to skin a cat in this game, often. Oh! Jesus! Magic. Where are we curvy pieces? Come on, you buggers. Look at It is like Tetris. They know. They just know, don't they? The buggers. They just know. And they just don't. They just know not to give you the thing that you want the most of all. Absolute bastards they are. Oof. I don't even know where I'm going at this point. Or what's going on. Oh, alright. Just that, I believe. Okay, and that. Is this why you have to make extra things to just like use up? Shit. Yeah. Oh my god. Who would have thought there'd be more to do? making these trellises all the way up. Oh no, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that one jot. There we are. Okay. me making these weird noises. Ugh. I've never done it before, like, played a game on stream before. It's quite weird, isn't it? It's quite cool, though. Oh, man. <gasps> How close I was to death then. Oh, my God. Shut up. Old game. Um, I reckon I can do that. Okay. Shh, 
And you see as well, you make enough vents and you can use more pieces in some ways than you could before, so it kind of works sometimes. Oh, someone please put a stop to this. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm not checking the chat. But I'm going to die if I do. So when I finish the level, I will check. And maybe go for a cigarette at that point, I think. Did you finish? I don't think. Did you finish that guy yesterday? Did you finish that boss? I missed it because I started the stream, didn't I? And I kind of fucked up with the timing. But did you finish that um, nut? The nutcracker? The son of the nutcracker? Alright, cool, cool. Yeah, as long as you guys are happy with, you, with your nonsense, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, well, that's it. That's, yeah, I totally agree there. Don Kingsley's uh, Donkey Kong channel. Um, I've never experienced it. And it's like, I don't know how you do it. I don't know how, when it's like a way more involved game. That's why I did something like this. Because it's like, you know, it's no, is it? Whereas like, if you actually had to, there's a little bit of time restraints on this, but nothing major. Oh, for God's sake, they're so fussy. Stop being so fussy. Oh, man. Well, looks like it's going to have to be that. Oh. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes, it's all, it's all new to me. But, yeah, if you're actually playing an actual game, I don't know how people do it. I'm sure I'll work. I'll get better at it. <laughs> I'm multitasking. Ah, oh, man, I like them fuckers. They're the twigs. They're the most fibrous of twigs, and they're absolute little bastards. They are. One of these little tuning uh, things. There you go. Have them. Have it. Okay, so two of them, if you please. Quah! It's like a big brass instrument. Quah, quah. Oh, kid, okay. What have I missed? What am I missing? Oh, there it is. We're getting close, guys. We're getting close. I can smell it. Ooh. 
Surprised they let me put one there. I'm there. Maybe I could try and use one of these. I haven't used one yet. There we are. Heard something in my house moving around. Not a mouse or anything. It's um, I've got a lot of um, fairy lights, a big long string of fairy lights, and I got random things to put on all the fairy lights. Some of them stay on, some of them don't work out so well, and so occasionally you get the odd thing just falling down randomly in my house because the fairy lights haven't quite stayed on. So it's a bit like a charm bracelet, I put made out of fairy lights, and it took me like a year to do it, and it was like a little mission, and then I did it, and then I was like, well now what do I do? So I started doing it in my kitchen as well. Oh, I don't know the difference between the monkeys, they kind of all look the same to me. What, 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 oh there! Oh, quick, quick, for the love of God. Yes! Yes! Legs Akimbo is, com is completely destroyed. I'll do one more level. Is it pluck already? Oh my God, it goes quick, doesn't it? When you... Bloody hell. But I would just sit and play three or four levels of this. Just... just... Not these days, I'm a bit too busy, but during lockdown I did. There she goes. Right, okay. So we've got next. Oh, look at this fella. Here, look, Sierra, it's you. What are you doing on that horse? Look at the state of it. What sort of a position? What's going on here? <laughs> He's like in action riding pose. And the horse is like bucking, jumping, half jumping, half standing. How was he? I can't remember. I watched the other one. Not the monkeys, the other one. What was the other one? There was the monkeys and there was another one. I can't remember. They were all on in the morning. There was Tintin, monkeys, hug wall, and what else did we have on at that time? I Dream of Jeannie, which is one of Vic's favourites, isn't it? I used to like I Dream of Jeannie way more than the other one, Bewitched. I much prefer I Dream of Jeannie because she had a better character and her outfits were way better and um she she was she went out with an astronaut hey oh mike yes this is amico mate this is amico maybe it was partridge family maybe it was i'm on the box fizz wrong don't you know oh yes i ran out of beer and i couldn't be asked to go to the shop because it was raining so I'm on the Bucks Fizz that I bought for Easter that I didn't drink with my uh, sister. So I'm drinking that. It's about the same percentage as beer. Oh wow, the music's come up and gone off there. Interesting. Oh, new music! I don't think I've heard this. Or is it the beginning of the old song? I don't know. Oh, that's right, that's right, another drunk. <laughs> if you ain't drunk, don't bother coming. I'm only joking. Mixed with a baby, it was a Brady Bunch. Maybe it was a Brady Bunch. Yeah, I'm not drunk, Luke. I'm not drunk. I'm literally, I've had a little bit of Bucks Fizz. That's it. It's nice to um, celebrate my 100th. Ooh, and night time. Oh, nighttime music. Ooh. Sad sin. Get them all now, these straight ones. Oh, I needed it there. Right, 
that's the way I want to do it. Oh, yeah, that'll work. Ah. This song reminds me of something as well. I love a song, but I can't. There's a song from the 90s and stuff, it's sort of like, like the hole of the moon or something like that. You saw the hole of the moon. What's this one doing? Nah. So, did anyone see that thing I put in the wing nuts in the Discord? That woman who was doing tarot? Fucking hell. It was only a short stream and I got to see her for like two seconds. Yeah, I'm super white. I don't know where my family mix from. Um, don't know. Who knows? Um, but yeah, she was unbelievable. Um, so she's reading her tarot and she had the right attitude. She was brilliant. I, I'm going to watch her, subscribe to her. Yeah, it's cool, isn't it? Do you know what it reminds me of? Did you ever play? Oh god, there was a game called like Spider Man. It was a CD that you got for the fucking really early, really early for the really old computer. It was like a Spider Man make your own cartoon game, animation make your own cartoon game, and it had all music like that. But yeah, she was reading these cards and she was doing it for Leo. She was doing it for, just for anyone who's a Leo star sign. And she's just really interesting. But then I noticed in the, in the thing, she had some big ones. She had a, a big pair, a nice pair, right? And there's <laughs> in the fucking chat, like your nipples out. And it fucking was. Her nipple was out. And she didn't even notice, she didn't hear me, she didn't read the chat, she was too busy reading the cards. And so she was there with half a nipple out for the entire reading. <laughs> she, was very, um, she was very done up, like very dolled up and had like, you know, when they shave their eyebrows off and then when people do that and then they paint them back on again. She did all that stuff. But, you know, her beauty, she was very beautiful. It wasn't like, unfortunately, she covered up a lot of the natural beauty that was there, but she was beautiful. But yeah, she's there with the bazongas out, literally nipple out. Whether she saw it or not, I don't know. Because then someone was saying, um, oh, it's come to this where you're just getting your, your boobs out for views and stuff like that. So who knows what, what goes on. But I thought that was quite funny for a tarot stream. You're not getting that from me. Um, but she was she was interesting when she did her readings. She wasn't doing tarot. She was doing some sort of little weird card um, where she just had a massive stack of them, um, massive stack of cards, and she was just shuffling and shuffling and shuffling until one fell out, and then she'd just read that, kind of like I did with Carl. She just shuffled like kind of aggressively, and then one would fall out eventually. Oh my god. Tough. Tough all books. Oh dear me. Thank you. 
Oh, oh Pepsi Man, I enjoyed that mm. when uh, Evil played that. Um, it was the music. It was just a fucking full experience, wasn't it? A full, um, a full multimedia experience. That stood the test of time. Oh, what? Fussy, fussy bastards. I've got loads of these. Why can't we use them? Oh my god. Well, this is no good. Absolutely no good. I'm gonna die now. Ah! Oh my god. I'm stuck. Oh, no, I'm not going to try once again. Mac and cheese? What are you talking about? I've had my tea. Well, that's that. That's that. Sierra, in honour of you, you have defeated me on this one. Yes, two pounds of cheese. I made spag bowl for tea. Very simple. But well, we did have cheese with it, and there was pasta involved. In fact, yesterday I did make mac and cheese, I'll have you know, but I did put chicken in it. Um, chicken and mac and cheese. If Mike's still here, what do you think about that? Is that weird? So that's that. Let's come out of here. How do I come out of here? Uh, there we are. Ah, so at least I've worked out. I know, I know. At least I worked out how to do that. Um, how to share another game. I might shall I do one more? I'll have a fag, and then if anyone's still here when I come back, then I will. And then I will continue and play another game. And even if anyone's not here when they come back, I might continue. Some Zuma. Why not? I've never played it in my life. My mum put me off. She put me off for life on it. I did have a nice thing. A nice thing. Let's put Lord Kip clips on. So I'll put him on while I go. While I go. I don't know what he's doing. Traditional music. So I'm going to leave him on. Um, oh no, don't dox myself. I don't think there's anything on here that's of any import. So he's in the pub, obviously. No one's chatting to him. So this is nice, isn't it? Um, right, so I'm going to take the chat with me, so I can still chat in the chat, but I'm going to have a fag, and I'll be back and we'll play with her. We'll play some Zoom. Thank you. 
to my freaking eyes, Darius trucks and Keith Elwood from Grace Road. On a scale of 1 to 10, how badly did Darius Truxton pretend to be busy over the weekend? 100%! 100% 10 out of 10, Darius Truxton pretend to be busy. Why? Because he has no car. He's in his mid-40s, like some loser out there that has no car. And that's not the bad part. It's not about having no car. It's about how, it's the fact that he never driven a car in his life 
and he's in his mid forties. All right, Queefy boy, the friggin' go karts at C and E don't count, you prick. All right, dummy, this guy's a piece of trash. And just a friendly reminder, everyone, that Darius Truxton sent his unsolicited shrinky dink B pics to friggin' Candace. Candace comes out with a video, a three part series by herself with nothing to gain, and there's still people out there in the community saying, oh, it's fake, it's planned, it's fake, it's planned. Hey, guys, get it in your head. There is Truxton is a friggin' creep. The same creep that instead of actually going out to Final Fantasy XI online to West Ron Fair to friggin' fight Jazzy Jackrabbit for that rare rabbit mantle, instead of doing that, this guy's running around like a goofball in Sandoria looking for his next friggin' female character to marry and propose to. Buy the cheapest 20,000 gil package because in real life, Dirty's Trucks. Happy human trade boy. You get 20% off kitchens when you spend 3,000 pounds on a kitchen. With flexible finance options, including up to four years interest free credit, start putting those big kitchen plans in place. Book an appointment in store or online. You can do it when you're being humans. Trucks also has no money. He doesn't have a full time job. We know that. He freaking lays in his freaking crappy little cat piss smelling mattress waiting for Apple One Agency to give him a call on his pay as you go phone to get your sorry card gets out. <laughs> oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. The goddamn bed, drive your little, ride your little stupid pink tricycle over to the most disgusting East Hamilton downtown warehouse you can find and clean turds out of urinals, moron. They tried before to put you in a freaking goddamn restaurant at Boston Pizza. There is Truxton was working at Boston Pizza. He, he, <laughs> thankfully, he got a freaking part-time job. Here we are. He at Boston Pizza like a good little teenager at freaking minimum wage. And instead of actually fulfilling his duties, what is Darius Truxton doing? He's in the dining area, hiding behind the pillar, staring at the server's black leggings. That's what Queefy... I'm does. the rest. On a uh, basis. He freaking stared... I'm the rest. How oh, does he not do it? No, but today it was crazy. Where was I? I was just walking back and I was walking along and there were some kids. Where was it? It was going to the school. It was dropping my kid off at school and I heard a parent shouting a kid as I was leaving and they went, Emily! Like that. And I was, oh my God, it was funny. But just laughing to myself. Emily! Wait, we are watching this. All oh, right, sorry, mate. Sorry, I'll put it back on. had girls and creeps all the time. That's why Alpha Nerd made a freaking video saying that Darius Truxton goes to Marineland that often to freaking go and look at freaking uh, people in bathing suits and shorts. The guy's a freaking creep incel. The same way, remember when Darius Truxton came on YouTube? He's like, Rochelle slash Rachel, please give me a call because through text messages, you don't understand what I'm saying. No, Queefy boy, you're a creep. You have no job, no car, no money, oh, no I. life, no girlfriend, all right? You probably sent those same D pics to friggin' Candace. Uh, yeah, my Candace missus. Friggin Rochelle slash Rachel. You're such a friggin' creep, idiot. And then now, next time you do no, this, is a new one. Supporters come to my channel with bullshit. New one, 55 uh, minutes ago. Story. Oh, there's this, there's this character. <clears throat> I don't know why people are believing that. I, I get it. You want to continue on the drama. I get it. You want to freaking add on oh. the drama continues and it's just all fun. Okay, I get it. But this, the story is so oh. makes up a story of some fantasy girl named Holly oh. who he sent deep pics to before because they were like liking each other. And then after oh. Holly broke up with freaking Darius, now Holly is using those same deep pics to conspire with Candace to freaking screw over Queefy Boy. Dude, Queefy Boy's already been screwed over. 2772. How does that one feel? Really? Yeah. Huh? Keep crying, Queef. <laughs> Keep crying, Queef. Dominoes again? Yeah, you're damn right, Dominoes. And we found out of your stupid celiac disease. Well, guess what? Domino's has gluten-free, extra stuffed crust, deluxe pizzas, prick. And we're sending them over freaking by FedEx. And on top bad. of that, Robert's getting well for a continue on. Like an Ewa. Way, April 26th is coming. Guys, April 26th, the day when Queefy Boy got fired yeah, from man. Frank Lampire. Level 1 Online came on YouTube and got Darius Truxton fired from his job at Frank Lampire. And all Queefy Boy, Queefy Boy could do to clap back was to ride his pink tricycle over to the. Where are you, Frank? The kid's asleep. 
don't be a fucking manhand and come have the fucking stuffy and come on the panel. <laughs> <laughs> He's such a nobbed. He was the one who fucking. Rocking the he was the one who banned me off his pan off Ricardo's panel, so he can fuck off. I'm never going on another panel of his ever again. He can call mine if he wants to. Eminem haircut. Prick. That's all he did. He did nothing else than that. Just cry like a little baby. And even the freaking commenters saw that video. Like, wow, Quinty boy. He sound a little down. He sound a little freaking crybabyness. Once <laughs> <laughs> happens, also count one the legend comes on the scene, exposes that, gets the schematics of the goddamn building, and then Queasy goes away for two three months like a coward because I printed some deluxe pizzas at freaking Domino's. And then he comes back like, ooh, Slotham doesn't bother me. Slotham doesn't bother me. Yeah, that's why you banned the word Slotham. Oh, anymore. God, that picture. And then oh, of that, you freaking cried to You just don't want to see that Twitter. face, do you? You don't want to walk down a fucking alley and come up against that face. That's just fucking scary. That's the dark, scary Carl. That's the fucking Nosferatu mode, Nosferatu mode yeah, of Carl. And then on top of that, you freaking cried to Team YouTube on Twitter, screenshotted my home video page. Domino's does suck. Said, hey, Big time. Not a fan of Slotham. I am a fan of Slotham. Not a fan of Domino's. Like a little cut. The same way you freaking cried to Chief Debo, some piece of trash who bent over for Syed or Angel Salt. Chief Debo! Every class needs a challenge, and every hero needs a sidekick. Choose North India. Debo banned me from seeing his messages. I thought he was a tough guy. I thought Chief Debo was from the streets of freaking Detroit, living in Section 8 housing, and the guy freaking bans me from seeing his messages. Pathetic. <laughs> and then Chief Debo's the same cock. That listen to Queefy Boy saying, Oh, I flagged Sloth on the channel because it's, it's it's out of control. That was his excuse. It's getting out of control. Really? That's, That's out of control. Okay, I'm just getting started. I am just getting started and burning. He preys on women. He preys on the reaction. He preys on the I guess he feels powerful in doing this to women. I don't know. Queefy Boy and burning the friggin' rats. You got Dave C. Some openly racist prick who beats his wife, drinks alcohol, and comes on YouTube and laughs about it in the comments section. That sack of crap went MIA for two days after Darius Truxton's D pick story, right? Then Daisy's not found for two days, right? Even though he's at always at every freaking Queaky Boy stream, he's not around for two days, and all of a sudden, two days after, he shows up in a Queaky Boy stream going, Oh, we're live. Thankfully, thankfully, we're live again. Not mentioning one bit about the D-Pick story. You're pathetic, Daisy. I thought you're a man of God, huh? Why don't you have a little powwow at a friggin' church in that stupid little room where you have a talk with the friggin' Pope or priest about your friggin' sins? Have a talk with Creepy Boy. And then you got James Campbell, some hobgoblin nose, 400 pound fat Estella White Mary Saka Craft, who has a masculine haircut and is 16 years older than James Campbell. Hey, James, you literally picked the most ugliest woman to ever friggin' marry, and on top of that, she has a kid from a previous husband. How did that one feel, idiot? You're so desperate, James. And I look online, I think your channel's gone good. Stay the hell out, no one cares, James Campbell. And guess what, James? The snake's already downloaded all your videos. I got the squishy, I got the squishy one. Look, oh, I squishy, squishy. It was before you left, so we got all the friggin' intel we need, and we're gonna find out more information about you, so keep crying, James. All right, dummy, your lover boy, Darius Truxton, is going to come over to save you. All right, dummy. And then, oh, oh, yeah, I just saw a stream. I just saw a live stream with Albert Menenka, one of the, the biggest cock in the retro gaming community. Albert Menendez, some five foot two shrimp, prancing around the streets of Florida like a shirtless prick, chain smoking cigarettes off the ground. And after that, he's going to configure his blue tent into a blue tarp behind Home Depot with freaking hobo sticks and shoelace strings while freaking stealing Wi-Fi. So the idiot goes live because he's from a restaurant. He's in on some restaurant where he's freaking stealing Wi-Fi. And then Kuya comes in the goddamn panel, serves him a bunch of pile of crap saying, oh, Albert, I'm sorry. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't know about Dunkley King, this and that. Basically lying and serving him a hot pile of crap. And what does Albert Menendez do? Oh, I respect that, Kuya. Thanks, Kuya. You're the man, Kia. Thank, I, I forgive you, Kia. That takes a lot of balls, Kia. Yeah, I respect. Shut up. Swap them. 
point for point part two. Shut up, Albert Menendez. You're such a cut. It's bad enough that King of All Buttocks came on here, said you live in a hole in the ground, you're poor, your home is pushing on a shopping cart, and you can't afford one of your shirts. And now here's freaking Cutia, for the lying to a bunch of crap right to her goddamn face. And the first thing you say is, thanks, Kia. Wow, that takes a lot of respect, Kia. I respect that, Kia. Really, you respect that? And then you got freaking Hey King. What's up? I'm telling you, Albert Menendez is one of the biggest cuts. I've ever seen in my life. Albert's the type of guy that if I were to go on the panel and say, hey, I'm sorry, Albert, I didn't mean it, he would start cucking to me. He'd be like, thanks, Slotham. Thank you, Slotham. Say thank you, Slotham. You're the most pathetic sack of garbage I've ever seen, Albert. You're not a tough guy. You're having this fake imagery like freaking uh, Darius Trucks, and you're all a bunch of fake. You're all a bunch of losers, and there's nothing you can do about it except cry on the internet. How about that? Huh? Yeah. Thank you, Slotham. All right, so that's that finished. What's this? All right, well, that's that. That's that. Full of harm. <clears throat> I don't know. So I'm going to. <clears throat> excuse me see about doing a another game from my list of crazy games i was trying to get zoomer up oh shit i put fiber twig on again i didn't mean to do that i meant to go on my location Okay, so where is Zuma? Zuma, Zuma, Zuma. Oh, of course it's right at the bottom, isn't it? Zuma Deluxe. Let's have a look at this. I've never played it in my life. No options. Aha, there we go. Zuma plays. <laughs> Peggle, I think that does ring a bell. Let's have a look. Um, haven't got Peggle. I've got Platypus, Poker Superstars, Puzzle Express. If you played Puzzle Express with Train, so that should be one that I'll do. Maybe when I do my big video, um, I'll do that one. There's Pizza Friends, eh? Puzzle Express, Puzzle Inlay, which is the game from these guys. Those are the guys. Um, Puzzle Solitaire. QBs, which is one of my kids' favourites. Regis Digest Super Word Power. I'm going to try that one. Ricochet Lost Worlds. Roller Rush. Saints and Sinners Bingo. That'd be a good one. We should do that. Um, Scrabble. Shapeshifter. Slingo Deluxe. Spellvib. Splash. Yeah, okay. Zuma it is. I'm on Zuma. Um, okay, close that. You are sharing your entire screen. It should have been. Share screen. Zoom really looks. Oh, it's allowing it. Amazing. Allow. It's allowing me to do it now. Strange. It should. Okay. Here we are. Look, Ron. 
Um, this is something, if Ron's still here as well, I want to do the buttocks and also Don Kingsley. This is, um, we're going to do, there is going to be a King of All Buttocks memorial stream, ghost stream. Right, okay, I don't know what I'm doing here. Whatever. Oh God, I remember watching my mum play this, fucking hell. Um, it's like Buster Move, right? Yeah, it's, it's just Buster Move, but moving. I'm a pretty fucking demon shot at Buster Move, I have to say. Oh, so it's about the combos. Ah, oh, bollocks. God, the hours I saw my mum playing on this fucking thing, my God. I always said I'd never play <laughs> I'm like, you're not playing on this fucking thing again, are you? Oh. oh, you can't see the game. Oh, no. Oh, sorry. Oh. Um... Can't see the game. Go back to the window thing. Okay, leave. Oh, is it just on there? Ha! Huh. I am listening. I'm listening. Listen, listen, listen. It's just stuck on that menu game, menu thing. The sharing window was working. That, oh, it was, wasn't it? It was. Okay. Oh shit. Right, let me take it off full screen. Yeah, I know I'm uh, I'm being really lame. Right. Yeah, let's go back to that. Um, stop screen. Present share screen. Entire screen. Allow. And then. Fingers crossed. Yes, it should work. Yes. There we go. The music. Ah, oh, I've never had stage fry. I've not shot any that miss. Oh, yeah. oh, nice. I remember missed. I think I played the demo demo for it, but I never played the full game. I liked it. it. Reminded me of Ico a little bit. I'm sure you have to get to the end. Ooh. I like how you get that right at the end. Oh man, Jesus. I bet the music was good on shrooms. It's quite like um, all encompassing, isn't it? And I won't be surprised if it's got subliminal messages in it. Like, not, not like bad ones, but you know how like Devo uses subliminals to accentuate the music. Or so he says. Oh, puzzle loop. Yeah. Steve O. I don't know if I did. I know a few Steve O's in real life. Or I used to. Uh, Oh, 
this is weird. It really does feel like I'm playing a mum playing a mum game. Playing there. Bollocks. I bet the music got proper stuck in your head with the mushrooms there, like, Kiwi. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This would be quite good on mushrooms. Oh, God. Yeah, well, that'll do. Yeah, that'll fuck you up. That'll fuck your brain up big time. Don't get me wrong. It's, it can be in the, right, in the right environment. It's fucking banging shit. But in the right environment. Watching Doctor Who. I cannot fault it. Honestly, it was the best use of um, of a drug. I was watching Doctor Who on the uh, Special K. Absolutely fucking amazing. We're going out and partying on it. Not so bothered about that. What's the point in it? If I wanted to sit, uh, if I wanted to sit in a corner being knackered and wishing that I was somewhere else, I'd probably be at home. Oh, they're moving a lot faster now. Oh, stewards, man. Ooh. Do you know who it reminds me of? In the um, 80s, there were those, like, little... It was like a ball, a plastic silver ball, and it had loads of little beads in it. And it was like a puzzle, and you had to get all the beads of the same colour and all lined up. I don't know if anyone remembers it. When all those executive toys were like a big thing and everyone started getting those metal balls that were in cradles and those fucking things that you put your hand in and it's made out of pins it was around that time. Oh my god. What am I doing? Oh my god. Oh. little frog bless him he's like a death frog or something no, it's the bat isn't it that represents death i can't remember what frog represented from when i read those books about it all Oh my god, I'm so shit at lining them up. Like.
this is all right. I don't know if I could play this for hours and hours though, like I could five or two. I could play five or two for hours. Why do I like Buster Move more than I like this? I wonder. Same fucking thing, isn't it, really? Oh, bollocks. I shot it where it was instead of where it was going to be. Lives left, okay. At least this one's got lives. Proper trippy, look at that fucker. Right, all right. Don't we? I can't afford to be making mistakes like this. fucking like it Like they go douche, Actually, I'm starting to like this game a bit now.
bloody hell. Oh my god. Sometimes I just literally fire it off at some random direction. songs i was douching douche douche yeah it sounded like it was going douche douche maybe think of ocean go on then just one more level it's quite addictive i bet no one plays these like obviously not this but like things like this on a pc anymore because these are just like purely in the realms of phone games now aren't they oh you bastard only old people old ladies they go on facebook and then they come and have a game on zuma oh i thought that was blue <laughs> yeah, douching. Douche, 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 douche. No, you heard it then. What? Douche. Assuming Zoom is a certain number of balls. Douche. Oh, ah. Yeah. That bust a move thing where right at the end where you just like shooting them to either side of the ball, it just never ends. Over that. Yeah, maybe I would have played this when I was younger because I was right. I love bust a move. Darius douche too. Darry douche. Oh man. Yeah, it's quite good. It's quite good. Put an arcade machine. Oh, puzzle, puzzle, bubble, bubble. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, there's one of those in the, in the video game museum. Mm. Okay. I'll have... Ace time was one minute. Okay, no. I'll give it in one more game. And then I'll finish at nine o'clock. Well, I'll I'll finish the game at nine o'clock and I said we'll back goodbyes because then I'll have done like a couple of hours then. Not that I've got any restrictions on my StreamYard hours anymore, which is nice. And I can just use StreamYard, which is so much easier. <laughs> Oh, 
on the box stood. getting close there. I'm a douche. Oh my god! A hundred and one subs! Woo! Yeah, man! That's it, I might have lose, lost at Zuma, but um, I got to level 2-2, two, two. so maybe I can do better next time. The, sim the Temple of Zoom Kulkan. I've had my dinner and I'm hungry again already. I had it really early today. Um, yeah, it's quite good. Top player is, jo well apart from me, is Jordan and Shannon. Famous for the for eternity, these guys. One sec. Yes, koala dinner. Yeah, thank you, thank you, Doshin, for the uh, support and getting me to a hundred. If it wasn't for Dawn, she'd have me probably 50. So, so there's that. Um, so, yeah, um, that is Zuma. And we will definitely play it again because I'm going to carry on playing all these crazy um, puzzle games. More games. I don't know, I'll take this with random old website. Yeah, I've got loads. I've got loads of them. Um, I've got loads of them so we'll go and do some more another time um, and it's now bang on 9 o'clock so that's quite a good time and it's like 2 and a half hours so that's a decent decent timing so thank you guys for coming I honestly thought I'd be playing it on my own um, which is, I would be completely fine. I was just testing it out. It was great to um, have some people in to test it out, but also for the fun. And it was really fun, and I've never done a 
a game stream before, so it was fun. It was fun playing. Thanks, thanks for the GG's, Evo. Um, and uh, I've got a renewed respect. I already had a lot of respect for you guys being able to play and talk and host at the same time and um, do all the things that you needed to do. So, yeah, I've got a massively new uh, respect for that because I don't know if you can do it. Um, cheers, Ron. <laughs> I didn't. I failed all the games. I failed them all, but I will carry on with Fiber Twig. Yeah, Chainsmoker <laughs> plays PC games from the mid-2000s that you got from your mum. It's very specific. It's mum games. Although I did think about doing RuneScape. Yeah, fail game. I did think about going down the RuneScape again. I, I don't think I could go onto my old account. I wouldn't even know how to how to find it. Fucking hell. Or what I'd have even used as a password. Yeah, fail game was fine. I'm just going to fail at all these games because I just don't have the same power. But I will do. I will do Fibre Twig. Um, and um, I'll probably do it on hard as well. Um, no, no, Sierra. No, he is not. No, he is not. Not at all. Mm. Jade Smoker tries to stop smoking as much by playing games. But yeah, I think I'm going to do more with that. It was really fun. Yeah, I know, Luke, isn't it? No, no, you're not. No, you're not. Anyone who could play games and host and talk and drink to the level that you drink is, um, in my opinion, not a failed gamer. And you're good at it. And you're actually good at it sometimes. <laughs> but speaking of which, I did ask you, I don't know if you answered, did you finish that guy, the nut, the nut thrower, the nut thrower from yesterday, from the Mario, from the plumber, from all seasons? I don't know if you did. But um, yeah, um, I'll definitely do this again. It might not be on a Monday regular, but it might be on a Tuesday. I might be able to do it on a Tuesday. So, all right then, guys. Well, um, thank you very much for coming. And um, maybe I'll even read out whoever's been here. There has been... We've got Don Kingsley's Donkey Kong channel. We've got Luke. We've got Curia. Evil, Sierra Nevada, and Sierra Air, thank you for coming. Um, that's the first time I've actually run into Sierra on a, on a stream, I think. Or maybe he came onto Evil's a long time ago, a very long time ago before anything happened. Thank you to Slotham for, put, for randomly having your video on that just came on of your own. Thank you to the, um, to the violin and the fiddle players of Glasgow. Yeah, thank you. Thank you guys for coming. Um, and yeah, cheers. 101. 101, there we are. Lovely. Um, and uh, yes, hopefully, if you're, are you streaming later, Evil? Because if you are, I will try and catch it. But now I'm going to go and chill with beans, I reckon. I might, uh, I might have another go on fibre to it, to be honest. Mm hmm. <laughs> All right, then, guys, uh, next time I'll try and do Minecraft as well at some point. That'll be way more complicated to try and do, but I'll try it one day. Okay, well, see you soon. See you around. Thank you. Bye. Time to flick the bean. Um, I'm not in the mood. <laughs> I'm not in the mood right now. You never know. <laughs> see you later.